what is going on guys ntb coming at you guys again with another youtube video and this is on the bluetooth speaker called joy high looking at one side of the box it shows you a brief summary of the stuff that it can do and on the opposite side it tells you a little bit more in depth the stuff that it can do and the stuff and the three colors that it comes in so i'm going to see if i bring it a little bit closer and hold it steady for you guys can see more or less what it does okay now looking at the front of it you have a base controller as well as a volume control not to mention your power a USB for you can charge out devices an auxiliary your C I mean your DC 5V charging you have your pause and play your fast forward your mode as well as your equalizer and an SD card slot. A nice little small screen that indicates what you have your mode on. An equalizer for you can set it to whichever one you want because there's five equalizing modes. Now I'm not a big fan of this charger. I don't really care for it because it's not like I have this around the house or I have plenty of these so if anything happens to this I would have to go and find another one that's the only thing I don't like besides the speaker you get your manual an auxiliary cord as well as your charging cord and the strap to carry this it's not heavy the speaker but it does have a little weight to it standing it up vertically is no problem you can listen to your music. These little notches that you see actually give it enough space for the music to let out through the bottom. Another cool little feature is it has its own little carrying handle that's built in. It's nothing special, but I like it. Now just putting the strap on, this is what it looks like. Now my actual review on this speaker. I've been testing it out for about a week. I think it's great. The only thing I don't like is just the charging uh, cord. That's it, basically. I wish they would have made it just a micro USB charger, but it is what it is. Overall, the little features that it has is pretty cool. I picked this up at a store nearby the house, and I think for the price, under $100 is worth it. For all the little knickknacks that you get, it's pretty cool, too. And it hits the highs and the mids pretty well. It's not too heavy in bass, but it is bass pack packed so my overall it's a good speaker i think it's worth the buy and if you do see it in the store and you're looking for a speaker this is a good first speaker to buy for somebody who's just starting out don't forget to like and subscribe comment down below check me out on instagram and i can't stress don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe drop a comment down below and if you have one of these speakers tell me what you think about it um, NTB signing out. You guys have a good night and a good day.